well, and I'm glad to see all of you here. I appreciate your being in Medina. As you gathered, I have a romantic attachment to this community, and I was so pleased that the governor mentioned the service of a man I've always admired, uh, and he was one of the founders of really this county's growth, as well as serving in Congress at the time of Lincoln. I also want to say that I have seen one heck of a lot of uh, governor's efforts in this category. <laughs> and uh, let me see, uh, Jim Rhodes, uh, and so forth. This, this was visionary. This was exciting for all of us who believe that Ohio has a great future ahead of it. I'm sorry I can't be back next session. It's sounding good already, and I, I would like to be there. But this, this was a challenging address. This was an address that gives the people of Ohio the understanding of what can be done in the future if we cooperate together. So it's a great privilege for me to have a chance to be with all of you and with the President of the Senate, who is a dear friend. Uh, this has been another great day. I think it, uh, it certainly uh, verifies the governor's decision to move the state of the state around the state. Uh, our opportunity to highlight and showcase Medina today uh, through their business community, through their uh, local community, through their downtown, I think is a tribute not just to Medina, not just to this county, but to all of Ohio. You know, Ohio has great communities all over the state. Most of you have heard me say this. We do more by accident than most states do on purpose. The reality is, as I've traveled across Ohio in my first year as Senate President, I'm always amazed at just how many communities uh, have greatness to be proud of. And Medina showed us that today. I was impressed by the governor's comments. I think his analogy, uh, his comparison to us ascending a summit as a state was a very good one. Uh, we certainly know where we started. We were at the base. We were in the valley. And I think it's our obligation as leaders and, frankly, Ohio citizens to continue to reach for that summit. The governor made a very, very appropriate comment that from where we started, we've come a long way. Ohio is doing better. But what I heard the governor also say is better is still not good enough. We're going to continue to work to do even better. We're going to do what it takes to ascend that summit. Not just for some Ohioans, not just for these Ohioans or those Ohioans, but for all Ohioans. And that's why we as a General Assembly have emphasized education. That's why we have emphasized making sure that we take programs that create jobs all across the economy. We're going to continue to keep that our focus. And if you know anything about John Kasich, you know one thing. He's not willing to sit back and rest. And I heard that challenge coming to us, Speaker, that we're going to have a legislative agenda that we're going to have to keep working throughout this year. And it's my hope throughout the next few years. So with that, uh, let's take a couple questions.